Competition, um, it relies on the individual solely to take care of all of the different aspects. That's what's so intriguing about this. You need to know how to sail the boat, how to trim the sails to make it go fast, analyze the weather, do the tactics, do all of these different things that uh, you alone are responsible for. My very first ocean race was a race from Fort Lauderdale down to Key West and that was with a crew. I grew up on the ocean in New Brunswick and I knew what the ocean was about, but, um, but that was my first ocean race with the crew. My first single-handed ocean race was with them um, by myself from uh, Newport, Rhode Island, uh, Bermuda, 600 miles offshore. The Spirit of Canada, to me, has, a, has its own life now and has, it pushes me along. I'm not pushing it all the time, it pushes me because we get lots of encouragement from people and uh, when I'm having a bad day, you just have to remind yourself of all that encouragement or read some of the letters or some of the emails or some of the people um, that are behind it and they just push you right through those bad times. The French creator of the race felt that it should be pure, no stops, no assistance, you can't go ashore, so it's a marathon of sorts. You must go around the world non-stop and come back to the finish line. The Open 60 is the largest boat allowed in, in uh, single-handed racing. Yeah, there's nothing after this. These are the ultimate uh, sailors. I believe that if you had any fear whatsoever, that fear would stop you from going.